I'm here at Fertile Ground today, and I'm with Gail, and Gail's going to tell us what Fertile Ground is. Hi, Gail. Hi, Camelia. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for having um, me. The most significant thing about Fertile Ground probably is that we're downtown, and we're in Olympia, Washington, right across the street from the library and two blocks away from the post office. And it's the most interesting thing about this place is what an oasis is in the middle of all this asphalt and concrete and noise. And uh, that's one of the things that people really like about coming here is because we're preserving this little green space here. We have this big garden and we do a lot of uh, classes and workshops here about sustainable living. We have uh, chickens, which will no doubt cluck while we're talking. And we have the CSA shed in the back where people come and pick up their community supported agriculture shares and also raw milk three times a week. And uh, there's all kinds of fun things coming and going, people having their meetings and parties and mm, just the high points of their lives. You know, they'll come and uh, rent a space and have everybody over and we have a cob oven where we make pizzas and almost every weekend somebody rents that space and sells pizza to all their supporters to make money for their little organizations. So we have all this fun community stuff going on. At the same time, bed and breakfast guests are coming and going. And they're kind of keeping the lights on, keeping things paid for by their overnight stays. They make it possible for us to keep everything open and happening for people in our community to come and use the place. And I just think it's a really great model for how you can uh, create a community space that people will love to enjoy using that is um, not dependent on the community to support it. Well, thank you very much. Is there anything else in particular that you think you should share with the rest of us about Fertile Ground? How about a website? <laughs> FertileGround.org. Okay, that's easy to remember. Yep. Thank you very much, Gail. Thank you.